Taking a look today at three stub axles for VW rear suspension. At the top I have a, a stock bug stub axle in the middle aftermarket stub axle and here is a Porsche 944 stub axle. One thing you'll note the, stub, the aftermarket stub axles often lack the metal shield for the grease seal and while the Porsche 944 dimensionally is the same here it takes a bigger CV joint a 944 bus or thing size CV joint will fit here. Years ago I replaced this axle, I was getting a lot of noise from that side of the car, I replaced the bearings and installed an aftermarket axle similar to this one only to discover when I was done the brake drum is a tremendous press fit on this spline so it's very difficult to install and remove. I almost wish that I'd put the stock axle back in at that time. But while I had these three axles at my disposal, I had them hardness tested on two different hardness testing machines. And in both cases, while the numbers from machine to machine don't match, the agreement is complete that the Porsche axle is the hardest and the aftermarket is the softest, the VW axle being in the middle. Now, the strength of steel trends with hardness. So, while I haven't had the wheel break off of the car uh, with the aftermarket stub axle, it does concern me that the product is marketed that is not as strong as the stock part it replaces. Also, for reasons as yet unknown, that side of the car where I installed the aftermarket axle has uh, now developed a tremendous amount of play. I don't know if the bearings wore out already or if something's gone wrong with the stub axle. So I'll be taking that apart soon. While I'm in the neighborhood, I'll point out, there's another Porsche axle. It's got this kind of a, I'll call it a barber pole striping, which I believe is induction hardening, or rather evidence of induction hardening. It does not appear that the stock Volkswagen axle nor the aftermarket axle was induction hardened. So I think that's it. I think I didn't leave anything out. Thanks and be sure and watch my other videos.